Morris Gray. I was diagnosed 20 years ago with heart. Uh, my heart was stopped. It stopped up. I have 11 stents in my heart. And when they put 9, 10, and 11, they blocked an artery and caused me to have a heart attack. Then four years later, I went to the doctor and he did an EKG and he said he needed to do a nuclear scan. So that was in May of 2011. In July of 2011, he did a nuclear scan, then called me and told me there was nothing else he could do for me. A friend of mine in Corpus Christi told me about stem cells in Panama. So I checked into it and I came down in October of 2011 and had a treatment. Didn't feel anything for 30 days. Then I started feeling better and really felt good. Went to the doctor in January of 2012, he did a EKG and walked in and said, what have you done? I said, what are you talking about? He said, you have a normal EKG. You've never had one of these before. So I asked my wife to ring out to tell him. So this was in St. Dominic's Hospital in Jackson, Mississippi the one I, that had caused me to have the heart attack. And so he, I asked her, Ray to tell him that I would got stem cells. She said yes, so I told him it looked like I had cut his throat. He was white as a sheep, and he wanted to know how did they do it, and I told him. Since then, I've had three normal EKGs uh, the last one was about two months ago. Well, I had another treatment about 11 months later, and it fixed my kidneys the second time. The first time it fixed my heart, didn't do anything else, but then the second time it fixed my kidneys. I've had, I had horseshoe kidneys, and I was operated on when I was 30, three years old, 35 years old, and now I'm 69. And my kidneys were grown together, and my kidneys has been bad my whole life, but now they're fine. Didn't have any other choice. <laughs> didn't know anything about it, but I didn't have anything to lose. But it is the best place in the world if you have heart trouble.